We're, we're asked the question about infrastructure priorities in every forum, and uh, it's as if the audience wants us to take a side, choose what's more important, I-69 or I-49 completion or the, or the river. I think it's all important. I, I think, I, and I don't know that that we, we can or should say, oh, well, I-69 is more important than completing I-49. I mean, I, um, they're all important to us, and there ought to be a way to, to, to chew gum and walk at the same time, and I think we can. I mean, the completion of I-49 is obviously critical. I'm not sure what the ultimate route needs to be, but we need to get this done. We all know what it would mean for our, for our area in northwest Louisiana. And I-69, of course, uh, has tremendous promise for us. Um, so we need, we need members of Congress to go and fight for those as priority funding matters. This is not some preference of some small special interest group somewhere. This is in the interest of the entire region, and everyone can openly acknowledge that. The numbers don't lie. Um, the Red River uh, is, is obviously key to us as well, and, and uh, we have to maintain the funding to have it properly dredged and, and um, to support the port, which is critical to us. Um, I mean, all those things are, are important. Mm -hmm. I heard an interview uh, this morning, an excerpt of an interview from the state um, DOTD secretary who said that, quote, there will never be enough money ever for Louisiana's transportation roads and highway needs. Um, it's kind of an ominous statement from the head of DOTD. I mean, there will never be enough money. I mean, we have a tremendous billions and billions and billions of dollars in, in backlog on these projects. But in spite of that, um, in terms of the federal funding, I, I was in the office yesterday with uh, with the majority whip, Steve Scalise, in Washington with, with the Bossier Chamber folks. We had a, a, a great visit with uh, Congressman Scalise. And um, because of his leadership role as the whip, he's been able to, to help steer some of this to make sure we get priority funding. And they were they were giving him the up update on the uh, the off ramp for Barksdale and some of the great improvements we've had, and, and how meaningful that is to us. And, and it was it was encouraging to us to hear the whip say, "We get it and we know." So it comes down ultimately to prioritizing the the chief needs among lots of other little pet projects. And I, I think we have to be serious about that, especially in a time when funding is so scarce. Um, to get those things done, and I'll, I'll be a, a fighter for that and for our region because I know what it means to all of us. I want my four children to stay here and be educated in Louisiana and raise their families here like all of us have, and, and increasingly that is a greater and greater challenge for our kids, so we've got to fix these things.